The Virgus Show is brought to you by Spanky Stone Hearth, casual fine dining on beautiful Rose Lake. Virgus State Bank, your locally owned community full service bank. Virgus Event Center for gatherings large or small, including weddings. Virgus Liquor Store, where all the profits profit Virgus. Make the right call. Call Hanson's, the most trusted name in plumbing and heating. Hi, welcome to The Virgus Show. I'm Sherry Hanson. Thanks for joining us today. I'm with Bev Flatland. Anybody who doesn't know Bev, um, well, <laughs> everybody should know Bev, but um, Bev is what I would call the champion American Cancer Society Relay for Life person in the community. I mean, I'm just, you just impressed me, Bev. What, um, you're, um, what you keep going and, and fundraising and all for the cause of American Cancer Society. It's, well, thank it's incredible. you. You know, but that doesn't happen without a story. So no. let's hear your story first. No. Um, I suppose my first big cancer loss was my mother-in-law mm -hmm. died of pancreatic cancer. My sister died of cancer almost 20 years ago now. It's been that long. Yeah. My brother has had a cancer thing. It's, it's just too prominent. And I get exceptionally mad when I hear of it in children. Oh, isn't that the truth? Yeah. Yes. Because I think what, um, what the society has recognized is there's probably very few families that are not affected by cancer yes. some way. Yeah. Yes. And Regrettably. You've a, and you've had a cancer scare. And I have, yeah, I have a relatively benign blood thing. And I have done chemo, and, and that's why I, I can't understand how you explain to children what they're going through. And what they're going through, right. Thankfully that um, by raising money and doing things with Relay for Life and American Cancer Society, a lot of it's about education. Yes. And then they are able to have those resources and those tools that um, can probably help kids when they're in that situation, help families. But um, it, it, it still just breaks your heart when yes. you, when you yes. see them going yeah, through that. It's so tell me about some of the things that um, the Virgus, how, how did you get involved with the Virgus Loonies? Um, I know you call it the Virgus Loonies Relay for Life team. Tell me a little bit about that. Okay. Um, Jane Christensen, when she left. Um, she used to be here at the bank in Virgus. She used to be here yes. at the bank and is from my hometown. Um, got me involved in it, as did Lisa Peterson. Lisa Peterson's the main chair over yeah, at the Relay for Life in Perm. Relay for Life. Mm -hmm. And I do have to do a little plug. Our Relay this year raised over one hundred and fifty-five thousand dollars. Just the East Otter Tail coming. Well, it's no longer no? just the East Otter Tail. Okay. Um, the West has kind of yeah. So we're now both moment. together. So we do have twenty-two teams. There are a few from Fergus Falls. We now have uh, a few from Pelican. Okay. And phrases, so it has grown that way. But yeah, we're. But you're the chair of the Virgus team, uh, the and Virgus what does that team. mean? What does that mean for the Relay for Life in Perm? I'm I'm the one that <laughs> tries to raise the money, <laughs> and you do a very good job Thank at you. it. <laughs> uh, raise the money here in Virgus. Um, I get the events going and. And so, and then you, you check with different businesses and, and, and they do um, donations and things like that yes. too. But tell the um, people out there how much money Little Community of Vergas and, and your small group um, organized. Our, our, our team raised over 16000 It was like... In 16, one year. Yes, in one in year, year yeah. $16,500, I believe it was. So I'm very proud of our effort too. Oh. And that goes with a lot of help. Well, you have, yeah, but you need that, that person that yeah. leads it, that spearheader. And so tell me about some of the events that have happened this past year with um, American Cancer Society, the Relay for Life team that raised that 16000 We did a fashion show, which we have coming up again, which we will which talk Which we're going to talk about that, yes. Um, we do an annual Christmas concert bake sale. You know, it's kind of nice. It's always that first Saturday in December. Yes. And it's a kickoff to the holiday season. Um, you can come and get some of your baked goods, but then you can just sit back and hear some wonderful Christmas yes. music, see some different things, and people just really, yes. I, I, I've really heard that they really like that as a beginning of their Christmas I season. I think, yeah, the last two years we've had weather events to oh, go yes, with it. Yeah. So that's, that's Minnesota, right? <laughs> yes, that's, that, that always puts a challenge on it. But um, we do a bunco tournament, which is a dice game. Okay, and where do you do that at? At Billy's Corner Bar, okay. um, typically spring. Mm -hmm. Last year we did a, because I do a Zumba class, we did a dance for cancer okay. at my class that raised 
over three hundred dollars. So I mean, every every, every, every penny helps. Right. We used to have a garden show. I know that was fun. That, yep. And and um, um, tr have tried different things like yep. that. We did a we did a pampered chef party. Okay. And so Last you just year, keep so coming yeah, up we, with new ideas yeah, and try to, and yeah. new people that are helping you. But today, what we specifically want to talk about is on September 10th, there's a fashion show, and that's yes. turned into just a wonderful event because not only does it benefit Relay for Life, it helps some of our local businesses. So yes. tell me a little bit yes. about that. Um, this was something Jane Christensen mm -hmm. started years ago. She did it in the spring, and and we've found that fall works better. A little, I guess a little yeah, bit, yeah, a little bit for us. So, so we try to involve just our local businesses and um, get the models, and everybody has a big time. Uh, Spanky's um, does the breakfast. Does the breakfast for us? We do a breakfast brunch. We used to do it at Spanky's. We have now switched to the event center because it's a little more space. Right. And, you know, there's something nice about being able to have that space when the models come out. And what I love is you use um, the local businesses, their their clothes. And what you hear every time is like, oh, I didn't know you could get that in Vegas. Yes. Yeah. Yes. yeah. 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 People are amazed, you know, and even I've kind of gotten into wearing a lot of the clothes from, I modeled for the Lavish Loon and, and um, people will say, well, where did you get that from? And where did you get that from? And I'll tell them and they'll say, oh, yeah. Which um, which clothing places will you be doing? The Lavish Loon? The Lavish Loon, well, we've had to kind of cut it down because there aren't many available this year, mm -hmm. but the Lavish Loon, Elm Street Boutique, and Forest Edge Gallery will be doing jewelry. Oh, nice. And nice. she has her own model. Okay. And so, so she'll be doing just as so besides. Okay, so people um, can get their tickets. So let's talk about that a little yes. bit. Their tickets are $25, right? $25 includes um, your brunch mm -hmm. and a mimosa or two which kind of really made some people happy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, the tickets, there is a raffle where we have items. Okay, so it's a silent auction one where you put the tickets kind in. Kind of sort yeah. of, you buy, you pay for, I think it's a dollar for the ticket, and you put it in a bag, and then we draw the ticket, the winning ticket. Okay. And that person wins. Um, what I are some of the you? items? Yeah, what do you have? I know that um, some of them are Relay for Life items. Some yes. of them are items that you are able to get that the businesses donate. This is a Relay for Life um, backpack. It's North Face. Nice. Very nice. That will be on it. We have some Yeti coolers. I see I'm using my backpack. <laughs> we have an Apple Watch. Brand oh. new. Brand, okay, that'll be nice on there. Yes. Um, and we have to have some clothing. It is well, a fashion show. Of course. Show. And then... And then, are you doing anything crocheted this year? I did. We have an Afghan we give away um, as that's a grand part of prize. A, that's part of the door prize. That's part of the ticket. Um, I made a baby Afghan. That's quite nice. cute. He's got a giraffe. And we're doing the flavors of the Flatelands again. Uh, yes, the flavors of the Flatelands. Um, Which is a basket and, and, and stuff my husband goods. has canned. Yes. Yeah, that's wonderful. And then I think this is also the opportunity to tell anybody if they um, have an idea that they want to donate a basket, that, that they yes. can get a hold of you, Absolutely. correct? Absolutely. Okay. Absolutely, yes. The tickets will be available um, at stores in town here, Lavish Loon, um, Elm Street, Elm Street right. the liquor store. And then they can also get it, them yes. from you. Or yep, or me, Natalie, Serendipity. Sure. And then, um, so you get your $25 ticket. It's September 10th, or it's yeah, September, September 10th. 10th. And what time does it start? 10.30. So 10.30 in the morning. Yep. You're out of there by noon. Yep. You come in, you get um, a brunch that Spanky's brings in. You get to see some clothing. You get an opportunity to um, yep. win some things through door prizes, but also get some silent auction items. And you get the chance to say, hey, I've, I've donated, and I believe And it's I a believe fun way in, to do it. Yeah, it's yes, a fun it's way to do it, and, and you're also helping Cancer Society. Yes. And so um, I think that, Bev, the, the fashion show is probably one of the fun things that people look forward to doing yes. because yes. They, they come in and um, we you know, decorate it up. Tell me a little bit about the flowers that will be there. Well, we are, we are going to have flowers from True Blue. Okay. We will have live bouquets on the, on the table and give those away. Yep, so you'll be able to At go home end, with yep. some of the so True Blue flowers too. you'll be able to go home too. with those. Um, more than likely we'll do some fall pumpkins sure. and it'll be beautiful and those kinds of things that I get locally yeah 
So everything's local. September 10th, you're going to want to come to the Vergas Event Center. You're going to want to help Bev and her efforts for the Relay for Life um, for American Cancer Society. And just have a nice day um, seeing yeah. what Vergas has to offer, yes. too. So yes. um, appreciate all you do, Bev. Oh, I really, well. really do. Thank because you. it is it is uh, a lot of work, and um, but it's for such a good cause. Yes. yes. Uh, all right. You have a good day in Vergas.